Well, hey guys, uh, today I wanted to explain to you how an air conditioning system works. Um, I get a lot of questions about this all the time, um, so I thought it would just be better to show you in a diagram. So uh, today we're going to be talking about a split system air conditioner, your Freon, uh, and how that cools your house and dehumidifies your house. So let's go to the diagram. So um, here is your split air conditioning system, and uh, let's, uh, I'll show you how this works. Uh, Freon um, comes in as a, oh, hold on, let me switch my tools here. Um, Freon, um, all right, so what we're looking at here is a split AC system. Um, let me show you how this works. Uh, Freon comes in as a um, liquid, comes in the liquid line, goes up to the expansion coil. Here it is expanded to a gas. Um, it runs through here, and when that happens, this, this is your expansion coil right here. That is very cold. It's very akin to, um, well, not akin, it is the same as when you spray the fix-a-flat on your car or the uh, stuff that you spray to get the dust off your computer. So, okay, so what's going on here is um, the air from your house comes in here, um, and this is the blower fan, so that air through the fan is blowing up through here. This is the furnace, but right now the furnace is dormant. Um, we're just running on AC mode, but the uh, air comes in, and it's blown across this, which is now cold. So this air coming up here is cold, but more than just being cold, here's the really important part, um, because this is cold and that air is being blown across that cold coil, uh, condensation develops on this coil, and the condensation drops in this tray. Much like if you take a cold drink outside on a hot day, condensation forms, so then the condensation runs out your condensation line. Um, now, that's why air conditioning feels so good, because not just because the air is cooler, but it's dehumidified. Um, so the air circulated through here, the air coming out is not only colder, but it's dehumidified because the moisture is here and it comes out the condensation line. But now if people do not change their filter, eventually dirt and debris, dog hair, cat hair, that sort of thing will get caught in this and it will block up and overflow. Uh, and that's bad. That's why a lot of times if this is in the attic, you'll have a catch pan underneath here and then it'll have a drain that'll go out by a window or something. If you ever see that draining out by a window, you know your primary line, which is right here, is clogged. Okay, so let's review. You have Freon coming in as a liquid, and it's actually warm, uh, and it comes in here and it's expanded to a gas, which is now cold, just like spraying the stuff, and then it's circulated back out. It goes back out as a gas, goes back out to your compressor, and it goes out here, and now it's actually compressed, which heat is released. That's why you feel heat when you go outside to that unit, um, and then the, the process starts all over again, comes back. So when it's in a gas, it's the bigger line, and it's actually cold, and it'll have insulation on it. Uh, that's gas coming from here back out to the compressor, and from the compressor back into the coil, it is a smaller line because it's compressed and it's warmer. Um, the line coming back out from here, like I said, is expanded to a gas, and it's cold. It needs insulation on it because if not, it's going to sweat, and whatever it uh, comes in contact with, you know, it's going to leak. So uh, you've got to keep insulation on that. So the way an air conditioning system ha works is Freon. It's constantly being circulated, uh, compressed from gas to liquid, expanded from liquid to gas, and recirculated back again, back again. When it's compressed, heat is released. When it's uh, expanded, cool is released. So that's the way it works. And then the, uh, the air is just blown across that. And obviously when the air gets to the temperature that you've set it for, wherever your thermostat is, you know, it shuts off until that temperature starts to raise again, and then it'll come back on. Uh, this has been Preston Sam uh, with Home Inspection Carolina. I hope that uh, information about how a split air conditioning system works was helpful. If you have any questions about home inspections, uh, please dial 704-542-6575 or go to homeinspectioncarolina.com. Thank you very much.